The state government has in the last seven years spent more than 3 billion naira to ensure full rehabilitation of the new Ede waterworks. The waterworks, which has the capacity to dispense 180,000 cubic meters per day, has not been maximized due to inadequate distribution networks and treatment processes until recently. TVC's Rafiu Hamid in this Sunday special takes a look at the intervention of the present government towards ensuring the waterworks dispenses water in, at full capacity. New at the Waterworks, which is the largest water supply installation in Osho State, has been in use since 1987, distributing portable water to about 13 local government areas of the state. But a few years after it was officially inaugurated in 1991, the waterworks became moribund and could no longer serve all the 133 benefiting communities in the local governments. Soko came the way of the communities within 100 days in office of the current administration led by Rauf Aregbesola. We must give kudos to the administration of Ogbeni Aregbesola because uh, I must say that uh, before he came on board, this place was producing less than 15%. In fact, the 15% I'm talking about was even made on impossible on many occasions because of uh, the fact that uh, uh, we always experience breakdown of plant and equipment. Most of the plant and equipment are dilapidated. They are in, in the state of unserviceable condition. And, but uh, in the first orange days of Ogbeni, he, as soon as he resumed uh, office, he was made to be aware of our problem and he quickly intervened. This is part of the interventions of Rauf Aregbeshola led administration towards ensuring that people of at least 13 local governments of Osho State have access to portable water. The governor also purchased a 2,500 kVA transformer, another 1,500 kVA transformer, 1,100 kVA generator, and all equipment needed to make the waterworks fully functional. All processes towards ensuring that portable water is produced are now guaranteed. Obeni did not stop at uh, giving us two low forms out of four. He wanted us to continue to produce at 100% at in stock capacity as designed by the, by the, um, as designed. So he went ahead, he did not stop at giving us uh, just two pumps. He went ahead to, to engage in full rehabilitation of the water works. And in, in that process, additional two pumps, which was required at the low lift, to enable us to produce at 100%, was purchased and installed. The government is not happy with some people reaping from government's efforts without commensurate payment. The most painful aspect of it is that most of this water is being used by those who say they are manufacturing water. The pure water operators. And you know recently, if you look in the corner there, you will find a lot of pipes there. Those are the pipes we just went to disconnect in those places. You find that we give them meter and they bypass the meter. They will do another connection underground. They will be using this water and they will be telling you that they don't use the water. Of course, their meter will not read because they are bypassing. But some residents want governments to work on the distribution networks, especially because of those in new sites. Because I've spent almost 20 years in a day here. So our uh, water is okay. You know, everything is uh, like the water. We don't suffer with the water. Everything is okay. You understand? So since where Alec Solar has come in, everything has changed. Thank God for the government. We are just praying to government to extend it to our area because there's nothing you can compare with government uh, facilities. Whatever a man do is just to augment what government should provide. We are praying to government to extend water to our area in Ashobo here. They also want beneficiaries to reciprocate the gesture by paying their monthly water bills and other necessary deals to government. As it stands, about six to seven billion naira is needed to fix the distribution networks for water to reach every home in the benefiting communities. This is New Ede Water Works, which was awarded as a contract in 1982 by Chief Bolaidi when he was the governor of Oud Oyo State. The water works was commissioned 
on the 4th of August 1991 by former President Ibrahim Badamasi Babangida. Since then, successive administrations have not done much towards rehabilitating it until Governor Rauf Arabeshola came on board in November 2010. Rafiul Hamid, TVC News, Ede, Washington State.